What's up guys, this is Osas from Samsung Galaxy S3 Soft Modder, and today I'm going to be showing you how to use the Toucher application. It's very similar to um, the iOS's Assistive Touch, and it's basically if you can't access your home button or your home button's broken or whatever, you can use this app to access some of those features that are there. So it's this green application right here, it's called Toucher, and once it's installed it'll add this little button here. So you just click on this button and it'll launch this app. I have a theme installed, it's a Windows 8 theme. From here you can see I can access my camera, my phone, the browser, my messaging, the clocks right there, and then this plus button, I can add another app to this screen. So I can add, I'll add the calculator, and I'll add uh, Drippler. Click OK, and then you see right there, there's my calculator, there's Drippler. The app's really cool, it looks great, it's really easy to use. You can also install other themes. You just click on click on the application and then it'll launch here. Then you can download these themes. You can get more themes, but the the regular theme is the default theme right here. It's pretty simple. I just apply that and go back. This looks almost identical to the, the iPhones. And you can see where you can access there. Um, if you do want to lock the screen, however, you're going to have to you'll get this little disclaimer and it says you're going to have to allow the administrator to allow your app to lock the screen. I don't know, it's, I don't know why, really, but um, if you want to do that, you just click activate and you can then lock the screen from Toucher. Um, I think that's, that's basically it. I mean, it's a really cool app, really simple to use. The themes are great. And if you have a broken home button, this is exactly what you're looking for. So just remember to like, subscribe, comment, and check out the full tutorial on Samsung Galaxy S3 Softmodder. All right.